what's up guys welcome to today's video today's episode is just a quick and dirty tutorial how you can make a text with a moving interior so with a moving color itself which i'm using for my tutorials or all of my videos as a marker so let's jump into LumaFusion. all you need is a clip the clip you want to have the text in it so what we are doing is adding a title layer just use the standard one lengthen it to the length of the clip double tap to edit delete the text field the original one add a new one choose the font and the size you want to have i recommend using a bold font because you want the people see that your text is different so in this case this one calling a tutorial making it thick so the people see what's happening in there changing the color to green because we are using a green screen masking to do this effect now jump back render out the video in the highest possible settings And this is the first step. Now delete the whole timeline and add the original video again. Or any other video you want to see underneath the text. What I recommend doing to make it look more artistic, more popping, double tap to edit and add some crazy effects. What I like is black and white, so I'm adding Noir, and I don't like the uh, yeah, noisy effects of the field and so on. So what I'm also adding is pop art and decrease the radius. So I love this look. So let's jump back at your rendered video above the original clip and edit it and add a green screen. Now play with the settings. This looks great. If you want to leave it like that, that's totally fine. What you're going to see is a the original clip of the same size inside it, but be able to read the text very well. So what I would recommend doing is edit the original text and change the size. So it's just filling the text field. And what you have now is a miniature version of your original frame inside the text field, which I love as an effect because it's moving with the original frame and the new frame. So it looks quite cool, pretty simple, pretty fast, and that's it. You can use it as an intro, as an outro, or just as a marker inside the text, or whatever you want to use, like be creative. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give thumbs up to my video, and see you next time, guys. Bye.